to this day, I can't put into words the feeling that I had throughout that whole day besides pure happiness. Hey guys, what is up? It's Jenna and today I'm bringing you a story time video. But today's story time is a little bit emotional. It's about the time I went to the One Direction concert. So emotional. July 11, 2015, I attended the On The Road Again concert in Santa Clara. It was the best day of my whole entire life. For four years, I had been dedicated to One Direction. I ran fan accounts, I have bought their music, I've supported them through everything, through literally everything, like literally all the drama. I was fortunate enough to get the tickets that I had and I just want to put a disclaimer that I'm not trying to brag at all. I thought in my life that I would have seats like that. I got so lucky. So I had the VIP package which you can attend the VIP party which I will put a video of the lounge right here. It was popping. Everyone was having a good time. Um, but eventually we got to go on to the field. After I got to my seat, I just remember being in so much shock because I had catwalk seats, so I was literally two feet away from the stage. Waiting for the boys to come out was probably the worst part. Can we just hurry this up? I need to see the boys. I need to see them. I've been waiting four years to see them. I need to see them. <laughs> Eventually the lights went out no. and the stadium went wild. The intro started to play. The door opened and they came out. I just remember crying and and screaming and knowing this is this is what I've been waiting for. I to this day I I don't know how to explain the feeling that I had at that moment. Every time Harry would come over, <laughs> my mom said <laughs> my mom said that I would scream at him aggressively and that I probably scared him. I'm sorry. I got a little bit too excited. A lot there's a lot that happened during that concert, but I just want to talk about a few key things that I I will never ever forget about that concert. I would say that number one thing that I will never forget is when Liam was reading posters and I brought a poster and it said all hail King Louie and he read my poster out loud with Louie with him and Louis pretended to put on a crown because on my poster there is a crown on the L. Can't see because there's a lot of good signs out there. This girl's traveled a long way. I saw you earlier. We did a little video thing, guys. Let's go here. All hail King Louis. Hey, hey. The Louis. Ooh, nice. I literally was like, oh my god. I can't believe this happened to me. All the people who were holding up posters, he read my poster. And he had Louie with him. And my fave, my fave, he saw it and he noticed me. And it was, it was 
one of the best things that ever happened to me. The thing that happened that I probably won't ever forget is when Niall Horn ignored me. It's kind of my fault. I mean, okay. I thought I was being funny. He probably thought, what is this 12 year old doing? So in one of their songs, <laughs> the lyrics are, I'll get down on my knees for you, right? I put the lyrics on a poster and I may or may not have put the smirking emoji next to it. They got through that song and I was holding it up but they never really like looked at my poster. And so I was like, what? Like, I thought hard about this. This is funny. I want them to look at it. So I held it up after when they were like talking and messing around and stuff. And everyone around me was like, what does your poster say? I showed everyone. They're like, oh, they have to see that. They have to see that. So I was like, all right, like help me out then. And so I held it up and everyone was like flashing their flashlights towards it. And they're like, not because Niall was right in front of us. And everyone was like, Niall, look, look at her poster, Niall, look. And um, he glanced and he, he like was drinking his water bottle and he was like looking at it. And then he just like looked away. He probably was really uncomfortable. Thank you so much. I want to say uh, to so many quick thank you. Any parents, grandparents? I remember wanting to be sprayed by Harry's water bottle so bad, but he'd always skip my row and Man, I remember them singing little things right in front of my face and Louie and Liam had that little bromance moment going on. <laughs> This is getting really emotional and I can't do this. <laughs> to sum it all up, I just, it was the best day of my life and I know everyone who was there probably had the best times of their life too. And yeah. I'm incredibly thankful to be able to experience something like that. I honestly, I really don't know how to explain my emotions during the whole concert. It was so over the top where I don't, I can't put into words how I felt. It was, it was, it's just crazy. I just can't do it. I don't, I don't know how to explain it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned next week for a new video. Peace out.